Hey, it's Brown Kickstart PPC, and today I'm going to be highlighting why you need to pause your scale insights automations. It's urgent you do this straight away as Prime Days just happened, and let me get into why. Now, first things first, to actually disable the automation, just choose the products that you want to disable the automation for, and just press disable. You can see there's nothing enabled there. And your rules are going to stay the same, but you can uh, you can just go go ahead after the time period and just go enable, and that will show up here. So first thing to do, just get that disabled. Now the reason you want to do this is most rules that you set up, and same with the default rules, are going to be looking back at least seven days. Mostly, you're going to be looking back thirty days. So anything where you're seeing the last seven days you're going to get it this big spike in sales that's happened the last two days. And if you haven't, for whatever reason, chances are you've been affected by the window shoppers because that's been a thing for pretty much everyone the past few weeks. So what you want to be doing is looking at, okay, in that period of time, are you looking back 30 days or seven days? That's what the default rules say. And also what the rules we do, we have a similar time frame ourselves. Are you looking back at those time frames? In the last seven days, you'll have had some of the window shoppers impacting the data, as well as some the last two days having a higher conversion rate and potentially lower ACOS. And depending what your rules are, lower ACOS could mean, okay, they're going to increase the bid. So you want to avoid having that. You want to make sure that your data is static, really, over the next couple of days. Even over the last 30 days, looking back the last couple of weeks, the window shoppers are making your conversion rate go lower, impressions higher, and your CPC potentially being higher, your cost per sale as well. So you don't want the bid being decreased because the algorithm thinks that you don't have a relevant term. So pausing the automation will stop that. And you know I recommend you wait a week at least before you stop optimizing things again. But... In a week's time, look back from today onwards, see where things are at. Probably start optimizing it from, from pretty much today's data, and that'll give you an idea of where things are at. Now, if you don't already have Scale Insights, which I assume you do just by the fact you're watching today's video, we have a promotion below. It's got a 30-day free trial with a 10% off lifetime discount. You can utilize that below for new Scale Insights users. If you want to learn more about Scale Insights, keep up to date with everything Amazon, PPC, FBA, subscribe to the channel. You won't want to miss out on what's up and coming and any of the previous content we've made. And in the case you need help with your Amazon PPC, you're struggling with something at the moment, you need some advice on Scale Insights, contact us below. More than happy to help you out. So if you contact us below, potentially work together, do an audit for your account and figure out where we can take your account next. Now, until the next video, hope you guys have a good day and we'll see you then. Bye.